It's completely gutted on the inside and destroyed, but it's impossible to get rid of. I see stuff like this every time we go out, sadly. Um, just this summer alone, we've probably come across at least 20 truck campers, motor homes, tent trailers, and it's because there's nowhere to get rid of them. So it's, people are dumping them. We've contacted numerous people around in the Kelowna area. None of the metal recyclers will take it because there's too much wood in them. Um, none of the scrap yards will take them. There's just, it's either too much wood or too much garbage, waste to them. Um, the local landfill won't take them. And if they're not going to take them, no, and we can't find somebody, then they're going to end up in our bush. They're expecting us to strip it all down um, and take it all apart and get rid of it individually. Well, the gentleman we got this from is disabled and can't do that. Yeah, I mean, it's not an ideal situation for sure. We would love to see, uh, you know, somebody that has the ability to to take these off people's hands and, and dismantle them. And I mean, if they can get them apart somehow and uh into their individual parts and send the metal to a metal recycler uh and the rest of the wood and stuff to the landfill that's uh that's generally the the main um way to dispose of these at this time there has to be something set up because right now the system's set up to fail so the only real way to get rid of it and not that i'm telling anybody to do this would be to pretty much torch it yeah. and come back with a big magnet and collect all the metal which is what we're trying to stop people from doing. It's so frustrating. Our group is a non-profit organization who goes out and we clean up all the illegal dump sites. Okay, and that's what we do. If you can't take items and we can't find a spot to take them, of course there's going to be illegal dumping. OFTF says that there needs to be a protocol in place to get rid of things such as this trailer. For Castanet News, I'm Elena Kelly in Kelowna. Read letters to the editor in our letters section under the opinion button in the yellow masthead. Email your letters to letters at castanet.net. <laughs>